hi guys it's me ada um welcome to my channel so i am so sorry for not being able to post videos uh i haven't been posting much lately that's because i've been busy with schoolwork so i decided to just focus on it first and then get it done and then focus on this so now i promise to be posting videos at least once every week so in this video i'm going to show you guys how i made this circle top or poncho that i am wearing it's super cute and it's very easy to make i use it to wear my um corporate um, trousers my skirts and even jeans so um, this is what it looks like when I'm standing yeah so if you want to know how to make this top please keep on watching this video and don't forget to like and subscribe and give a thumbs up if you like this video and if you found it helpful in any way thank you guys okay so I have about one and a half yard of fabric so I'm going to use it to make my circle top or poncho so first of all I'm going to um, fold this fabric in half in two equal halves like this then I will also fold it fold the half into two equal halves again as well so so this is what we will have after folding into equal halves. I'm going to uh, measure my neck. For my neck, I'll be using a neck width of five inches sorry of four point five inches so I will mark four point five on the fabric then for my neck depth I'll be using um three point five inches so I mark the three point five then I will join the two points by freehand so this is my neck now after marking my neck I'm going to mark the full length of my the length of my top I will make it 17 inches so from the point where you have marked the neck just measure downwards to 17 inches then uh, plus my one inch allowance which is 18 inch my whole fabric is kind of exhausted but i'll still mark the point anyway so 18 now you keep um marking 18 from the point of your neck so that you have like a semi This is eighteen. So I will just try and join it by freehand, join the points. So I'm going to cut out this semicircle and then this will be our top. Now I'll just use my scissors to cut out. Confirm so this is what my circle top or poncho looks like. Uh, you can go ahead and cut the wire strip for the neck and then you just go ahead and sew for the neck. I 
I'll measure my neck. So my neck is um 14 inches on a fold. So that means my bias strip is going to be 14 times 2, which is um 28 inches in length. So I just got this remaining piece of fabric and I'm going to measure 28 inches downwards. So this is where my 28 inches goes. I'll mark that point. Twenty-eight. Now my bias is going to be two inches. So I mark two inches. So now I am done sewing the um, circle of the top, but I want to mark out a portion of the top for my sleeve. Now I didn't use any serious measurements, I just um, looked at the outfit and decided where I wanted my sleeve to kind of be. So from the end of the fabric, I marked, uh, I measured. Just about 15 inches downwards and I mark that point. Then I use my ruler. I use my ruler to measure Six inches, six inches. So I drew a line upwards, six inches. So I'm going to sew from this line down. Then I did the same for the other end that is for my right and left ends. So I also measured 15. Uh, I also measured 15. So this is 15. And I also use my ruler to measure 6 inches upwards. Then I'll use my office pin to hold the, the two parts so that I can sew on it and it won't move use my office pin as well to hold this part then I'll just go to my sewing machine and sew on the right side on both right sides 